Hi foodies and welcome back to my channel. Today's Sunday so I'm going to do a Sunday, kind of a Sunday roast. Um, me and Mario don't often have a Sunday roast. Um, I found these legs of lamb. Now there's two in the pack. The original price for them, <coughs> excuse me, the original price for them was €8.12 and, and I got them for €4.06. So these were out last night thawing out. Now for my vegetables, I'm going to be using carrot. Whoops. I'm going to be using cabbage. And obviously you're going to be using um, potatoes. Because I'm going to do my own roasties and my own mash. Now I am going to do the lamb in two different ways. Um, one will be seasoned, one won't be for both our preferences and I will be doing a normal gravy for Mario and I'll be doing a minted gravy using this so yeah I don't usually use jars but I, or I try not to but I don't have any I haven't done any I don't even have any mint so that's the reason why I'm going to use that. But every, everyone has their own preferences. Um, yeah, so let's get cracking. Let's get cooking. So the first thing I'm going to do is prep my vegetables. And yes, Red Knife has made a comeback for this one. Just for the tops and tails. And then we're just going to slice the carrot. Now you can use whatever veg you want, whether it be fresh, frozen, that's entirely up to you. Now I won't be doing any Yorkshire puddings with this one. Sometimes I do and sometimes I don't. And with this one, I'm not going to. So because I'm gonna watch my fingers, I'm just gonna cut this cut at the end there. And then we're going to put them into a pan. And then we're going to do the same. Now, as I did say, you can use whatever vegetables you want. You can use whatever seasonings you prefer. I'm just showing you the way I'm doing mine. As I said, this is a special treat for us because lamb is usually very expensive. And in our supermarkets, I don't see it very often. So this will be a real nice treat for us. So that's my carrots done. Now I'm going to do my cabbage just roughly. Again, you can use as much or as little as you want. Probably not the best way to do it, but... Just move these green ones because I'm going to use the green. 
And again, you can use as much or as little as you want. So I'm going to be using roughly half a head. And then with these ones, I'm just going to roll up and I'm just going to roughly chop. And yes, yeah, stop to still in them. Or should I say they're spines? So that's my cabbage. So I've just picked my spuds up. Now these are um, Irish roosters. And we're just going to cut these into quarters or half and half again. Now I'm using about four potatoes for our mash. and three potatoes for our roasties. So again, into quarters. And what are you having for your Sunday dinner? Are you having a roast? Are you having something different? I'd like to know. Put it in my um, comment box. I will be back with Around the World Recipes and they will be back next week. Yeah, I've not done the Yemen dish yet. So that one will be the first to do and then it'll be back to the beginning and there'll be a poll on that so you can choose your preference of a country you'd like me to do And I will do that. So we've just this one potato to do and one more. And as for the skins, I'm not going to throw them away. I'm going to be making some nice potato skin crisps, whatever you want to call them. And I'll do them in a nice flavour. I'm not sure yet what flavour, but we'll see when I do them. So now that's my potatoes done. I'm going to put my lamb as I'm doing it to do different ways, I'm going to be doing Mario's first. All I'm going to be doing is putting the lamb in my air fryer on roughly 180 and do it in half an hour increments, turning over. I will let you know how long it takes that for them to cook. So while I'm waiting for the other leg of lamb, I'm just salt and peppering this one, I've already put the salt on. And then just gently 
rub it in and you can see there's some at the bottom there so I'm just going to rub that in and I'm going to let that soak there for a few minutes so as you can see in my small pan here I have my potatoes parboiled bashed them around a little bit with a pan lid on and I've added some olive oil and they're ready for roasting so I'm going to let them cool down a little bit before I do the roasting now I'm going to show you how I do my gravy as you can see I kept the water from my cabbage there's little bits and pieces of cabbage still left in there and I'm using the Bistol powder and I've added a little bit of water in that as you can see there and I also put the juices in from the lamb so now we're going to pour that in there and we're just going to heat this up until it thickens up and Mario will be having his gravy plain and I will be having my minted so I'm just going to do the gravy as is like this before I put it onto Mario's and then I'll show you what I do with the rest of the gravy that I will be using for my Also, um, I did a little trick with um, my mash, which I've already done. Um, I just mashed it with butter and milk. But I have a different way of um, serving it, but I'll show you how I did it. So we're just going to continually stir this until it thickens up. Now each leg of lamb took around 45 minutes on 180 and then another maybe 10 minutes on 200. And then I let that rest for about 10-15 minutes. Always let your meat rest. So when this is um, thickened up, I'll bring you back. So now you can see the gravy is thickened up. So I'm going to put some onto Mario's plate and then I will show you how I'm going to finish my gravy off. Now Mario's is done, so it's the same gravy. And all I'm going to do is add some mint sauce and we're just going to heat that through in there. You can put in as little or as much as you want. And that's your minted gravy done. So the next time you see all this, it will be on a plate, ready for a taste test. And there you can see, that is Mario's. And as you can see, what I did with the potatoes, I'll tell you how I did them in a minute. So I'm going to give this to him. And then we'll get on with my one. So as you can see, this is my one. Now I've added carrots because I like carrots. Um, and as you can see, there is the lamb. So let's give this a taste test. So as you saw, the um, potatoes are not just thrown on. 
A little trick I learned is if you've got an ice cream scoop, instead of scooping ice cream, you can scoop your potatoes just to make them look a bit more presentable, I suppose, depending on what you um, want to do. So, I'm going to give this lamb. A taste test. Now that's what it looks like and as you can see I've got some of the um, salt and pepper. Mm. It's so nice, it's juicy. The crust on that with the salt and pepper. Perfect. And then you pair it with that minty gravy. Mm. Absolutely delicious. There's potato, mashed potato. Absolutely really nice. Mm. And try carrots. She does have a little bite, but I cook through. Now, when you that's what my roasty looks like on the inside. And then on the outside. Absolutely perfect. And we try some of this cabbage. There we go. Whoops. Again, has a little bite but it's perfectly cooked so yeah that's my roasted lamb with minted gravy sunday dinner if you like the content please give it a like please consider subscribing click the notification bell for new uploads don't forget to leave a comment in the comment box and watch out for tomorrow's special recipe because it will be a challenge for two YouTubers. But more of that tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Have a great Sunday. Have fun. Re relax. Just have a great Sunday. From me, goodbye.